Hi from sunny Scotland. This is, uh, I've been trying to make a video for so long and everything's going wrong. So my audio has been messed up. I lost so much audio on two things. On my flight over here, it was full of veterans. There was 10 veterans coming, going over to Holland. And uh, it was so nice. I had an interview with one of, I interviewed one of the guys, but uh, I lost the audio. There was nothing and a couple of other things. But look at this church here. Very old church. A very old back street here. And coincidentally, I came at festival time. Yes, festival time. It, it commemorates a battle in 1514 with the English. I'm going to have to get someone to explain it because I have tried so many times and I can't explain it properly. But I, I, everybody I ask, they all tell me like in 10 minutes. I said, can you cut it down to one minute? But look here. I love this. I love this place, this old graveyard. There's so many old graveyards in Scotland. For over 800 years, there's been a church here. This is the oldest part of my town. And all the gravestones here, they're, they're, they're just ancient. I'll go for a walk around it later, maybe. But for now, I am going down to the pub. So let's go to the pub for a drink. Hello, girly girly. Hello. Oh, hello, what are you doing here? What do you mean? What am I doing here? What do you mean? No, 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 the camera. Not paparazzi. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jimmy. I'll play back here. Good, good, good. Are you coming in or are you yeah. He's coming back. Hiya! So all the horses, they've come back from a little town about five miles away. Look at this little girl. So cute. So they've been at a town like five miles away, but this is them all coming back from a ride out. As far as I know, the pipe band is in the pub. I think they march all the way from there into the pub.
Welcome. trying to explain that this is the oldest part of the town here. Over here was the tower. I mean, this place dates back thousands, thousands of years. Look, look at the, the horseshoes here. I don't know what it signifies. All right, let me explain something. So I, I came back at the time where there's an annual festival, which is called the Common Riding. And it is in commemoration of the Battle of Horns Hole. Battle of Horns Hole. Battle or skirmish some would say, where the, the English, because this is a border town where I am, I'm 50, like 50 miles south of Edinburgh. So the English used to come to all these border towns. Here's Andrew. Hi, Andrew, come here. All right. This is Andrew. Come and say hello. Hello. Who am I, Auntie Emma? Yeah. Yeah. What have you been doing in the graveyard? Swinging about. Swinging about. about. Horses, what do you think? What? Digging up corpses. What Digging up corpses. Look at this. What is it? Willow Oh, okay. It's Let been me see. swinging off the willow tree. Oh, gosh. Yeah, it, oh, looks, okay. it looks hazardous as fuck. YouTube will probably like that. Okay. Okay. I kind of got the fear when he started. All right, you're it. just grabbing some branches there? No, no, no. no. Check this out. Oh. <laughs> that looks fun. Do you think I could try it or do you think they would break? They'll break because you're too happy. Oh, <laughs> go well. Yeah. Okay, so I got as far as saying, oh, sorry, I was interrupted there, um, about this town hundreds of years ago. In the year 1514, there, the skirmish, the battle, because the English used to come around here and pillage, plunder the towns and villages. But the young, the youths of Hoyk had got word that the English were camped out not far from here like a couple of miles away from here, there was an English camp. So the youths of the town went out there and they had a battle with the English, them English, and they got a flag back and they came back to the town and basically they saved the town. So all the other towns in the borders had been burnt, um, burnt down, everything stolen and, you know, um, so we commemorate this. This happened in the year 1514 and the reason that it was only the young guys that went was because all the men men were killed the previous year in the Battle of Flodden. So the Battle of Flodden was like a huge loss for Scotland against England. Them Englishers again. Uh, so it's so hard for me to explain this. So I hope, I hope it kind of makes sense. So anyway, they do this festival every year and it was just coincidence that I came here for this festival. It's every year and it's a major, major thing and it goes on for weeks, every weekend before, and it's always like the first weekend in, in June. It, it actually is happening next weekend, but it's just basically a major booze fest. So that's the, be that's the best way I can explain it. In my I'm still trying to explain the common writing. Don't oh. ask me, it's the wrong person. <laughs> <laughs> so, so I've done my best. <laughs> I hope some of that makes some sense anyway. Andrew. Hello. Good morning. So um, 
This is a continuation from last night's one where I, with the bagpipes and the band and everything, um, my voice is a little raspy with singing too much. So I'm going to take a walk along the street, the main street here. And uh, hello. hello. How are you? And these are some friends of mine. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? So I'm always, so this is the thing here on the high street. You always bump into somebody you know. This is one of the things I do miss about living in a small town like this is everybody knows everybody. So I'm going to turn it this way anyway. All the flags are out for the festival, for the coming right in. But it was so funny, somebody said um, they were driving into Hoik and they said, wow, you're really going out for to support Ukraine here. <laughs> And it just so happens that the uh, the flags are blue and yellow. They're Ukraine covered, colored flags, but they're not. It, this is the the, the Hoik colors. It's a very old town. I don't know how exciting this is. There's pubs. So the oldest part of the town was over here, and that's where I was last night. There's a butcher where you get your haggis. Um, it's June. And the weather is typical Scottish weather. So I was this, uh, uh, the festival, the common riding is on Friday and Saturday. But I was not planning on staying, but now I'm like, should I, should I not? So I can't, I, I can't decide whether I should be going or not. I just wanted to show you the street. It's a Sunday, so it's not very busy. And I have tried to get my daughter on video and she doesn't want to and my mum doesn't want to so basically i can't get anybody any of my family on video yellow and blue yellow and blue lots of closies there's a river down there i left here when i was 18 to go to london but it's always home and it always will be i definitely can't see myself living my old age out in america because you can't afford to get sick there but here in the uk um it's free health care so here's the horse statue here so this is the horse aka ken the horse and this depicts the battle from Horns Hole in the year 1514, where I explained last night that that guy on his horse got the flag from the English that were in one of the border towns. We're right in a valley here, so it's a valley and there's so many lovely hills around, so you can just go walking in the hills. Most people do that, they'll just go walking in the hills, because you can, because you can walk anywhere you want here. Unlike the USA, where we, where I live there, there's lots of hills and stuff, but you can't walk on them because it's classed as trespassing. And they have the right to shoot you. Good old USA. Hello, how are you? Good night, how are you doing? I'm all right. Oh, yeah. Hello. 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 <laughs> this is another friend of mine from Hello. Hike. <laughs> this is Kai. Lovely dog. <laughs> I love this dog. Where are you off to? Really? Another friend. Uh -huh. See, I am from Scotland. To those people who still don't believe me, this is my town. It's really a nice time of the year to come. The only thing is never guaranteed here is the weather. In summer, it can be August and it can feel like March. It's, it's, really, it's really hit or miss the weather. So I just came down here. Another old street. The river is down here and they're building walls on the river. I'll have to take a walk down there because um, the last few years they've been, it's been flooding. When I was a kid it never flooded. So here I am. Little back entrance right here. I'm going up to see my mum. Okay, I'm going to sign off for now. <laughs>